How long will this nightmare go on? I think you'd be perfect for my new photo series on retro grunge. You have the same qualities that I loved in Rachel Amber, but not Max. Max is a fucking child. Oh, Christ, I know. And she never shuts up, does she? I'm so over her hipster bullshit. I think everyone at Blackwell is over Max. Let's prove it. Booyah, Warren. I thought you were all over Max's shit. Not after she kissed me. Her breath was ass and no tongue. I hear that. I'm not into nerds, but you're pretty cute. I'm not into Max anyway. So let's bust a move. God damn, you are a sexy bitch. Why hang out with Max, huh? Boredom. Plus, she's like my personal puppet. I hear that. Do you want a party? I got a drugstore in my room. Oh shit, look at Max spying on us. Take a fucking picture, bitch. Or take a selfie. See, this is how you bust a move, Max. No mosh pit for you, shaka bra. Damn, Victoria. You're a real woman. Not a little girl like Max. I fucking love your tats, Chloe. You're so hot. I can't believe it took us so long to hook up. Why did you get rewind powers? You don't even know how to use them. Rachel's dead and you're still alive? Life is so not fair. I wish she would have never come back to Arcadia Bay. You're the real storm. Great, numbers are all over the place. How will I find the right code? I'll be so grateful if this is the last digi code. Why doesn't the mirror reflect any of the numbers? Don't kill us, Max! I guess I'll never dance again, Max. Right when I was about to start a new life in California. Shit, Max. I can't Max. believe you kissed me. I thought we were on the same team. Now you're going to kill me? Now Max, I'll die alone. please save us. Save the Bigfoots, Max. Please. Honey, I always thought of you like a daughter. And now you're gonna take me away. From my family. Why would you do that? It's okay if I'm gone. 
I've paid my dues. Time to pay yours. This is not how I wanted to spend my last hour. I on know Earth. I haven't That's my been husband the best and new baby. To you. We'll Don't have to go without him. I wish we had been friends, Max. But please, don't let me die like this. I'm still a teenager. Who... Who are you? Holy shit, are you serial? I'm you, dumbass. Or I'm one of many Maxes you've left behind. Can you get me out of here? Oh, so you want help? <laughs> Thought you could control everybody and everything, huh? Twist time around your fingers? I tried to help. I only wanted to do the right thing. No, you only wanted to be popular. And once you got these amazing powers, your big plan was to trick people into thinking you'd give a rat's ass. I do care. That's why I was trying to make friends. By telling people what they want to hear? You were just looking for a shortcut because you can't make friends on your own. That's not true. I have great friends, and I've used my powers for good. Please, stop playing innocent. You're a goddamn hypocrite. You've left a trail of death and suffering behind you. That was not my fault, you son of a bitch. Don't you dare talk about our mom that way. <laughs> what about the crap that was your fault? Wait, wait, let me guess. You fucked up time and space for your precious punk, Chloe? <laughs> you think she's worth all that? Of course. She's my best friend. Oh yeah, you ignored your best friend for five years while she went through hell. <laughs> Some friend. Chloe does a better job of guilt-tripping me than you do. Because you let her bully you. It's called Stockholm Syndrome. But you didn't do that homework, so you'll have to learn the hard way. Like Rachel. Just shut up. You're not scaring me anymore. I'd be more worried about Chloe killing us than Jefferson. Max, do you really think she's our friend? That she respects us in any way? Man, you are so stupid. I'm embarrassed to have the same name. And someday Chloe will destroy... Oh hell, speak of the devil. Dude, do not even fuck with her head! She knows what we went through together this week, and you don't! There's no way you can break up our team! This is reality! After five years, you're still Max Caulfield. I am seriously glad to see you. Welcome home, Max. Fasten your seatbelt. I, uh, know it was your birthday last month. This was my real father's camera. I want you to have it. Yes, of course it's cool. Thank you. This camera is so sweet. Now that we got that mushy shit out of the way, I feel like stage diving. Let's thrash this place. Yep, yep, I'm fucking insane in the brain. Let's dance. Shake that bony white ass. Or this song, this song fucking rules. Can't dance, hippie? Come on. Rock out, girl. Yo, turn it off. Turn it off. You need to hide. You were here today, Max. You saved me. I'm still tripping on that. Seeing you after all these years feels like... Destiny. If this is dest- Let's talk about your superpower. Epic. I pledge allegiance to- Welcome to American Rust, my home away from hell. Raw and rough. You saved me again. Crazy. Now we're totally bonded for life. Since you're the mysterious superhero, I'll be your faithful chauffeur and companion. I'm so glad you're my partner in crime. As long as you're my partner in time. Max, you better come check out these files. It's not a drawing. Look. Cowabunga! Why look, an otter in my water. Let's call it a draw. I'm gonna freeze my ass off when I get out. You look 
cute with your hair. Photo bomb. Photo hog. I double dare you. Kiss me now. Sorry, not that easy. Uh, oh, we could cruise everywhere in this bad boy. Can you see us heading down the coast of Big Sur and beyond? I know. Just daydreaming. Not until I see it first. You know the rules, Dad. Dude, I am so lucky that my father is cool. It's weird hanging out with you again. I know. I'm glad we are, though. Whoa, awesome picture. We look so badass in our pirate gear. Chloe, you're back. I'm just... Kate wasn't the first. All those binders are filled with other... Rachel! No, Rachel, no, no, please not her! Chloe! <laughs> Rachel! Come on, Max, we're almost there! Please wake up! Wake up! Wake up! Max, come on now! Don't worry! Don't worry! We'll be okay! Max! Max, can you hear me? Please say something! Chloe? I... I must have passed out. Oh, thank Sorry. God! Don't you ever do that again, okay? I swear. But that nightmare was so real. It was so horrible. This is my storm. I caused this. I caused all of this! I changed fate and destiny so much that I actually did alter the course of everything! All I really created was just death and destruction! Fuck all that, okay? You were given a power, you didn't ask for it! And you saved me! Which had to happen, all of this did! Except for what happened to Rachel! But without your power, we wouldn't have found her! Okay, so you're not the goddamn Time Master, but you're Maxine Caulfield! And you're amazing! Max! This is the only way. I, I feel like I took the shot a thousand years ago. You... You could use that photo to change everything right back to when you took that picture. All that would take is for me to... To... Fuck that. No. No way. You are my number one priority now. You are all that matters to me. I know. You proved that over and over again. Even though I don't deserve it. I'm so selfish. Not like my mom. Look what she had to give up and live through. And she did. She deserves so much more than to be killed by a storm in a fucking diner. Even my... My stepfather... Deserves her alive. There's so many more people in Arcadia Bay who should live. Way more than me. Don't say that. I won't trade you. You're not trading me. Maybe you've just been delaying my real destiny. Look at how many times I've almost died or actually died around you. Look at what's happened in Arcadia Bay ever since you first saved me. I know I've been selfish, but for once, I think I should accept my fate. Our fate. Chloe. Max, you finally came back to me this week and... You did nothing but show me your love and friendship. You made me smile and laugh like I haven't done in years. Wherever I end up after this, in whatever reality, all those moments between us were real, and they'll always be ours. No matter what you choose, 